So we're at Taco Bell right now. We just finished up the, the fab sale. It was uh, it was really nice. What do you think about it? Um, it was really cool, to be honest. In the beginning, I wasn't impressed at all. I was like, let's get the fuck out of here. But and I started looking at some jackets. And I don't know. We had a lot of jackets. Yeah. Uh, How much did you say we ended up buying? Like eight, nine? I bought three. You bought three? I think you I bought, bought like five. Five or so four. eight, yeah. It was crazy. We bought a lot. It's been super expensive. We bought it for like around sixty dollars pretty much. And honestly, there's some really nice stuff there. Um the I don't know, the, the person, the cashier, she was really nice. Oh, great customer service. She was actually a... Uh, she makes music. She makes music. I'll actually link her song in the what description. Was like, what was her name? Jenna Lynn? Je she? Jenna Lynn. Yeah. I'll be on the lookout for Jenna Lynn. She's fun. She fun to pop off. <laughs> Abar, Abar, however, has... Never mind. Um, I'm cleaning that part out. <laughs> don't say that. Okay. Um, but you know, she's really good. I'll be on the lookout for her because she's really... Um, she has some good stuff. I'm not going to lie. It came right she's after... one good song. I mean, she has one song. I mean. Jesus, no, she has dude. one song. Oh that's good. She's releasing an album soon. Okay, y'all be on the lookout for that. She's gonna blow idea. off, and then we'll probably be like, you know what, Jerilyn? If it wasn't for us, we wouldn't got famous. If it wasn't for this vlog right here, right here, and then she releases the album tomorrow, gets famous, and then we release the vlog. Yeah, there we go. There we go. Oh. That was messy. Mm -hmm. It really was. <laughs> fun. So, how'd you how'd you enjoy the so my Skittles shake? I just got a drink. Slushy. I mean, okay, you were gonna ask something. Yeah. How was the um, how was your experience with the uh, building popping that we did? Oh, that that was really fun. Um, felt very adventurous while I was doing it. Um. I'm glad we found ways into places we didn't think we could get into. Um. Yeah. I felt like God was really looking out for us, so, you know. We didn't get in trouble at We didn't get in trouble, and there were just, we the just door, got into places. Open doors, yeah. Yeah, oh, literally open doors that shouldn't have been open, we got in. Um, not every door is open, that's asking for way too much. We're grateful for what we got. exactly, but. There was one place that we got to, hella nice view, and this, it just so happened that this dude was leaving the place, so we just went in after him. So that worked out. Yeah. I mean, I'll sh they'll see it. I think they recorded it. No, I probably didn't record it. Like, um, just as a heads up, my battery died twice. Both my batteries died. I just charged it in the car, and so that's how we're recording this now. Um, we're gonna charge it again. We'll try to get some footage at Galleria. Some footage, but if not, this is gonna be our like bye message. Right mm -hmm. But what have you learned from this experience? That's kind of what I was gonna do right now. Oh, are you? <laughs> yeah. Great minds think alike. Mm -hmm. Because at the end of the day, it doesn't matter if your battery dies. It's, it's what's in here that counts. It's a vlog, dude. We're, mm. not, we're not doing a. <laughs> And doing anything crazy. <laughs> a life coaching session. Honestly. What's that guy's name? Um, Gary V. Gary V, there we go. I That's love Gary Brian V. Right there. Honestly? Is, I can see it. Is he a role model? One of He's one of your role models? I just I just like how he's so genuine. Yeah, it is true. And like how he's the only guy that I know that would cuss like that. Yeah. No, he cusses. Like when so he's yeah, much, he does. Yeah. And you don't think that would fly, but I mean look, it's flying for him. Like if you don't fucking fucking fucking, I'm like wow, this guy's just going in. He, he does always, and so I really like that. And, and he's so angry but calm. Like I don't know how he calmly yells. How does he do that? That's a skill. That that is what he does. Calmly yells. Yeah. I should look him up if you need some inspiration. Really good guy. Um, he's very big on social media, so like you've probably already seen. Probably him on already, that's true. Yeah, yeah he really is. But I mean, people like him. People like his personality. People like his genuineness. You know, he's not the what's the other guy? Ty Lopez, the guy who's like, see, they both have in like my Lamborghini or whatever. You they know, both knowledge. are like successful, but it's just that Ty Lopez is very. I feel I get a cocky vibe from the guy, but I still respect his work and what he's done. You know, you can't deny a man's hustle. That's what he's done. I've never done a vlog before, so we're kind of just eating. 
Hey, really? Talk a lot? That's fine. Right, that's crazy. You know what I might do? What's up? I'll upload a separate video of all this ranting, and I'll just put some of it in the actual vlog. Mm -hmm. Okay, yes. Yes. I mean, just we haven't even started ranting, man. That's crazy. Start ranting, let's go. Well, gay people. <laughs> um, I'm bleeping that out. Okay, no. <laughs> okay um... Hmm, let me think here. Um... Damn, I really don't know. Oh, fanny packs? Let's be honest, guys. Never... I don't know. Like, why are they trying I think to... Even, what do you think about them? Even good-looking people can't pull it off. Unless it's off to the side. You know how people do that? It's like a little front off inside. That's fine. But when it's like right there, above your crotch... Uh-uh. No, you, you feel it. Yeah. I don't know. I kind of like them. I kind of don't. I'm like, love-hate on them. Because I feel like sometimes they look nice, but... Sometimes that you're just trying too hard. Like, for example... When you unnecessarily flex, that's I think that's a very good thing to rant about. Like for example, I went to a concert. You know, you know, everybody there was trying to look nice, right? This guy was wearing a Supreme background. And you're gonna go into a concert where it's like mosh pitting and shit. That backpack's gonna go flying or it's gonna be super heavy. So he had to take it off when he scanned for security anyway, so like it doesn't matter. Or when people try to sling something over their thing because they think it's fashion or I don't know. We need any tissues. I'll be right back. We really do. You guys ever do like mug frogs before? Never really respond to them. I do it though. I'd be going in that shit. Ah. Mm. I'm back. I hope you didn't say anything incriminating. No, I don't think so. <laughs> Let's talk about mug bombs and how they're like. I, don't I actually know. haven't seen a single one before. I didn't even know they were a I thing should, until uh, YouTube rewind. I should start you with one. Um, like, what do you mean, show me one? I'm gonna show you one, and if you feel like watching anything else after that one, uh -huh. watch the um, search up salmon. I'll put muk, in the link in the description. Lo look up salmon mukbang, mukbang. Wait, how do you pronounce it? it? Is it mukbang? Yeah, it's mukbang. Okay. And it's gonna be either some dude who's kind of chubby, or some dude who's like skinny. And I think it's called the Salmon of Desire. It's very passionate, I'll say. Yeah. Salmon? Um, I'm dead up. Is it like make out with the fish? No, no, it's pretty much, I think, like, it's kind of what it is. The, the skinny guy. Okay. The chubby guy kind of just goes in, but it sounds really nasty. But the skinny guy, I think he's literally making out with the fish. <laughs> but, okay. it has like a million something views, so I mean, like, I'm not against it. And I'm, I'm, I'm only adding to that by watching it at least once a day. Once a day? You got a fetish? Honestly? I could. I don't know if I'm the only person that does this, but... I put fire sauce and I nacho cheese. That's smart. Because I feel like the cheese is overwhelming. Like it's overwhelming. You can, yeah, you can really taste the, the cheddar. Bro. So I put some hot sauce in it, add a little spice. Mm. How's your Baja? Uh, no, what is it? The Skittles? Strawberry? This thing right here is gonna be like multiple brain freezes. Um, it's really good. That's why I didn't get one. I knew it would be too cold. And it's like, what, 40 degrees and stuff? Yeah. Honestly, I think we've got to use it to the cold. Our hands were like freezing. Oh, yeah, I know. I think that's a point where. I, I just feel it. You said feel it? I was really worried that my ears were gonna be like a numb. Mm. But it, it wasn't. My face was fine. I think we got used to it. That's what happens. Is that what, is that what happens with Canadians? They just get used to like negative 10 degree weather. And they grow another layer of skin. Yeah. That's a skill, dude. No, you know who, who did? Eskimos. Like after thousands of years of evolution, their skin is like a little bit thicker. I didn't know that. I, 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 I didn't know that either. I read about that like... Like two years ago or something. Mm -hmm. So I finished my box. Hold up, I'm still, I'm still catching up. <laughs> I know, I'm sorry. I eat really fast. No, I eat fast too. No, see, because like, I feel like my friend said that. Yeah. Okay, one time I was on this summer trip for this, uh, just like some summer program. My friend, his name is Daniel. Um, it was all five of us eating. 
and we were all like going in and we finished our food and he's like damn you guys are fast and he's like you eat slow as hell he's like I eat, I eat faster than anyone in my family I'm like how slow does your family eat then wait your friends called you slow mm -mm. we call Daniel slow mm -hmm. not in that sense but in the eating sense yeah yeah He was like, I ate faster than my family. I was like, hmm. You want to head out? Yeah, let's go. Is there anything else you want to talk about? This is going to be a whole separate video. Like, I'm going to put the beginning part on, on the vlog, and I'm going to put the rest of it. Like, you said, it's already like 10 minutes long. I'm going to put the rest of it as a separate video. Just be like ranting with Brian at Taco Bell. Okay, yeah, we can do that. Um, Any last well, topics? One last topic, um, live life and do everything you want to do. Don't regret unless, anything. Unless it's illegal. Don't. Even if it's illegal, no regrets. No, no, no. Brian leaves the room. All right, what I press? The record button? What? The record button? Yeah, you can press that.